hello everyone welcome back to my channel hope you all are enjoying my passing strategy series especially for the vtu students and uh, today i am with another subject that is principles of programming using c uh, that is its subject code is bpop that is principles of programming s103203 that is in first semester it is the third subject and in second semester it is also a third subject over there who are having backlogs in this particular subject also uh, it is for the regular students this video is for regular students also if you want to score if you have wasted uh, your whole semester and now you are searching for how to pass this particular subject uh, i will discuss some important questions related to this uh, subject that is principles of programming using c most of the students uh, are fearing are struggling about this subject if they have not understanding the concepts over there so module first that is introduction to uh, c over there so in in which you have to cover some theory concepts it is a theoretical based chapter over there which is a passing module you have to cover theory from this uh, particular module but i have taken some important questions which you have to focus on so first of all define computer describe the various types of computers based on speed memory and cost or sometimes price they will give over there next question is explain the structure of c program in detail write a sample program to demonstrate the components in the structure of c program so my dear friends there are uh, probably there are 16 programs in this particular subject which everybody should cover over there if you are a computer science branch student so you have to focus on the pro uh, programs over there but if you want to pass this particular subject then some programs i will mention in this video over here which you have to ponder on which you have to focus then you can easily pass this particular subject you don't have to worry about 16 programs you have to uh, focus on only uh, four to five or six programs over the year then uh, what write a short note on the characteristics of a computer it is the theory theoretical question which will be asked over the year uh, write a note on the following operators like re uh, relational logical and conditional operators and different types of errors occur in the program so these are the theory, uh, theoretical concepts which you have to focus in the module first otherwise this is a full module is a theoretical which is a passing module module over there if you have a potential to cover all the theory you can go through uh, deeply in this particular module and you should go according to me if you are the uh, what we call software engineer so you have to go through this introduction to see it will be very help for you people in the higher semesters itself right then in the module second explain with syntax if and if else statements in c program it is the most important question if we consider the 18 scheme it was uh, almost in the every examination video was asking this particular question that is if and if else statements right in c program explain with the examples for uh, example formatted input output statements in c this is another important one and explain switch statement with syntax and example right then distinguish between the break and continue statement this is again an important super important question that is break and continue statement so focus on these four questions and also <coughs> another part right write a c program to find roots of quadratic e equation so this program is much more important than other programs so you have to focus on the quadratic equation and write down the uh, c program to find its roots over there then write a c program to point whether a given number is palindrome or not you may be already known about what is what does the palindrome mean over there if i will tell you uh, suppose i am the citizen of the kashmir over there and my native place name is magam that is m a g a m so magam is a palindrome if we just reverse it it is again in magam m a g a m magam right m a g a m magam so it is a palindrome like madam is over there so so many palindromes are there so you have to just write a c program to point whether a given number is palindrome or not then illustrate nested loops in c with suitable example so these are the six questions which you have to focus in the module fifth otherwise there are a lot of programs over there as i men mentioned here there are 16 programs in this particular subject so from the module two you have to uh, you have to cover uh, these uh, particular two program uh, programs over there right so then module third comes up so in the module third so most important question is explain the declaration and initialization of one dimensional and two dimensional arrays 
with an example this is an important question so you have to memorize this you have to focus on this uh, particular arrays over there so this is the first one super important question and explain working of recursion with suitable example write c program to find the product of two given matrix it is again an important program in the module third so in the module third one program is over then discuss the implementation of user defined function with suitable example uh, then uh, you have to focus on this particular program which is a super important i can see over here that is write a c program to implement bubble sort technique that is in ascending order so you have to write down the program over here so these two programs you have to cover in the module th uh, module third over there so these are the four programs which i mentioned uh, among 16 programs then you have to focus on some little bit theory that is scope of variables and recursive functions you have to define some recur uh, recursive functions over there so this much content is enough for the module third to cover this <clears throat> particular portion then module four comes up my dear friends in which two super important questions uh, probably three are there which i have marked here what uh, that is explain get ch and put ch function with example and what is pointer discuss pointer arithmetic with suitable c code uh, especially it contains uh, two chapters over there one is string part and another one is pointer part like uh, right uh, so these two questions are the important ones that is what is get ch function put ch function with example what is a pointer discuss uh, pointer arithmetic with suitable c code explain the difference between a null pointer and a void pointer pointer variable declaration and initialization with a suitable example and next one is develop a c program to find the largest of three numbers using pointer so this is again a program so five is the numbering of the programs which i mentioned here then develop a program using pointer to compute the sum mean and standard deviation of all elements stored in array of n real numbers so again another program right then write a program to compare two strings without using built-in function so these concepts are enough to cover the module fourth my dear friends so yeah, as i mentioned it consists of two chapters you can go through this particular chapter that is pointer chapter over there no need to go through string part over there otherwise syllabus is vast you already know then module fifth comes up write a compute write and compute average marks of the students list the students scoring above and below the average marks for a class of n students this is again an important program in the module fifth then differentiate between structure and union next one is discuss different modes of operation in files with suitable example and also go through theory concepts according to syllabus in this module fifth so i think uh, this much content is enough uh, this much uh, theoretical concept is enough to pass this particular computer science subject also you can score more than 70 to 80 marks by covering this much portion if you are if you're having some potentials over there to cover all the syllabus portion if you want to score you can go through my dear friends you, and you have you, and you should go through all the concepts so that it will help uh, uh, in the higher semi higher semesters itself over there so